Burlington firefighters confirm they had this blaze under control around 11 o'clock last night, but they continue to pour water into the hot spots of this uh, building here at Paletta International in Burlington. This fire was a fast moving fire, very aggressive. As a matter of fact, because of the collapse of the roof uh, as a result of the fire damage down to the second floor, Burlington firefighters had to take what they call a defensive posture. They couldn't send firefighters into the building to find the source of the flames and to knock it down. They simply had to pour water onto it from outside. Now, luckily, we are told uh, upwards of 200 uh, employees would have been in the building at the time of this fire. Everyone who was able to evacuate the building safely, there were no injuries. Just one injury to report uh, with regard to a Burlington firefighter who suffered a twisted ankle on the job, but I'm told that firefighter will be okay. The Ontario Fire Marshal will be sending investigators out later on, and they will probably be using heavy equipment to pull apart the debris to essentially uh, extinguish the existing hot spots of this fire and, of course, to begin the process of trying to figure out what exactly caused what was a massive blaze in the afternoon hours of yesterday. At Paletta International at the QEW and Applebee line in Burlington, Kevin Meisner, City News.